Hey guys, it's Khaled, and I'm going to show you how to make Ubuk. Now, what's Ubuk, you say? Well, I'm glad you asked. It's not, it's, um, it's not a solid, nor a liquid. What is it, then? Well, it's, um, well, it's magic. Actually, it's science, but I'm not going to show you guys that right now, because we are going to make our own little magic. So... Here are the materials. Cornstarch. Water. Any kind of water. Food dye. Any color. And containers to mix it and put it in. The first thing you're going to do is get your container and cornstarch. So, what I'm going to do is three scoops of cornstarch in a bowl. It doesn't have to be leveled. It could be as much as you want. I'm just going to do three. Here comes the magic activator. Water. This, if you pour it, doesn't matter how, how much you use. You can do like a drop and then you mix it. Then you <laughs> so, now I'm going to get my spoon and mix it. <laughs> Well, I didn't add enough water. So if you don't have enough water, you can add and then stir. Stir. Seems like I have enough water. Nope. Do I? I don't know. Just seems like it's hard. So when it looks hard or feels hard, that means you you might be you are doing it correctly. So I gotta add more water. Cause that wasn't a lot. Now, we're going to stir it again. Now, if it gets hard, then that means you're doing it correctly. If it's soft still, you have to add more water. And you can add as much cornstarch as you like or as much water as you want. Now, now I'm going to stir this and we'll be right back. Well, now if it looks like this, that means you have done it correctly. If you feel, if it feels like a liquid and a solid, then that means you are doing it correctly. Now, time to add the food dye. Now, I'm going to put this one as red, and you only need two squirts on how much on each side. Now that you put the food coloring in, you can now stir it. If you don't have food coloring, you don't have to do that. You have it already set if you did this. So now I'm going to spin it. So this would, might take a while. So Now that we're done stirring it and adding the food dye, we can now play with it. Now, if you want it to last longer, you could add a container lid to, so, it would, so we could preserve it. Or... You can put it in a plastic baggie and play with it so you won't get sticky. Now, see? Isn't that fun? Now, you can make your own magic. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!